Hey guys, hope you're well. Welcome back to the channel. We've had two of the hottest days in the UK, so I hope you enjoyed yourself. So guys, back today with another restock video. As you know, I made a few videos a few days back and some of that stuff came to fruition. We had the Amazon drop that happened recently. It happened yesterday. So a lot of people messaged me saying they managed to call from that Amazon drop. So I'm really happy about that. But then a few other things to kind of recap, talk about in today's video before we end this week with the Easter bank holiday weekend. As you all know, that's coming up Friday, Easter holiday. But just to close out the week, I thought I'll do this video and talk about what's coming tomorrow. If there is something coming tomorrow, you know, so you need to keep an eye out on this video, guys, and make sure you watch it today. And also, guys, I'll be talking about some news that we managed to get, some great news we managed to get in regards to Ratchet and Clank. And this is Ratchet and Clank for the PS4, not the PS5 version. We all know that's coming anyway. But this is good news in regards to Ratchet and Clank PS4, so please watch out the rest of the video to hear about that as well. So loads for you in today's video, guys, so please keep watching. And guys, as I always say, remember to hit that juicy like and subscribe button and follow us on our Patreon, Instagram, and Discord channels as well. And guys, before we talk about what's incoming imminent drops, let's talk about what has already dropped. So guys, thankfully, as I was telling you in my previous videos that I made, that Amazon was going to drop this week and we were on the ball. We were on the ball with the time. We were on the ball with the drop, which I'm really happy about because due to that, some of you managed to secure yourselves a PS5, which is amazing news. So guys, Amazon dropped 30th March, Tuesday, around 8.34 a.m. They dropped both the digital and the disc edition PS5s. And I afterwards received messages from people on Instagram. I received messages from people on my live stream when I was doing my Last of Us live stream last night as well. They said they managed to call from Amazon, which makes me really happy because usually Amazon drops, I get messages like, oh, it was really buggy. We didn't manage to buy it. It sold out really quickly. So I was really happy to receive those messages saying that we managed to cop a PS5, we managed to cop a PS5 from Amazon. So guys, do let me know in the comments if you managed to get a PS5 from Amazon this week. What was your experience? How did it go? Any tips for other people? And for people that didn't manage to cop from Amazon and you're looking forward to getting a PS5 from Amazon, don't worry guys, as per PS5 stock informers, there might be another Amazon drop around the April 13th mark as well. So I don't know whether the 8K stock we were talking about, 6K stock they had we were talking about, whether they just gave everything in this one drop or whether they kept some back to then drop it in the later part of April. So who knows, perhaps they have a bit left over, which you're gonna drop in the other half of April, but we'll keep you updated on the next drop that's incoming on Amazon as well. But again, congrats to all the people that managed to call from Amazon this week as well. Guys, we also had another interesting drop, which was EE. I'm not sure if you know about that, but EE dropped as well on the same day as Amazon, 30th March, and they had dropped around 8 a.m. But again, this was only for existing EE customers. So they were the only ones that managed to cop this drop. Let me know in the comments if you were the EE person that managed to cop the PS5 from them. And how was your experience? Did you manage to buy it? Did it sell out quickly? Let us know. It's always interesting to find out what's happening in all the other stores as well. So yes, EE dropped alongside Amazon yesterday as well. And guys, now let's move on to what could drop potentially tomorrow. These are high alert type of stores. So guys, the first store that a lot of PS5 stock informers have been talking about is Smiths. So they're saying that Smiths could drop tomorrow potentially. 1st of April, which is tomorrow, and don't get it confused with April Fools. I hope they're not trying to do an April Fools on us because it's not 1st April yet. But yeah, I hope it, Smiths isn't trying to do an April Fools on us because that would be really annoying. Can you imagine if they do the whole drop and then say, oh, sorry, April Fools. Man, that would be brutal. I hope they don't play with people's emotions like that. So let's see what happens. But a lot of people are saying that Smiths could drop tomorrow, potentially for sure. And the times you need to watch out, guys, are 8 to 9 a.m. again. As you've noticed, like a lot of these stores are dropping around that same sort of slot, which is 8 to 9 a.m. Game always drops around 9 a.m. Now Smiths is dropping 8 to 9 a.m. I'm sure Very was around that early morning time as well, but we'll check on that later. But yeah, guys, keep an eye on Smiths for sure, 8 to 9 a.m. tomorrow. Keep an eye on it. Let's see what happens, whether it drops or not but worth keeping an eye on if you haven't gotten a PS5 yet. And guys, what people were saying was that there were some changes to the Smiths website that led to people specifying why it's gonna drop tomorrow. So they were saying that the purple banner on the website got removed. The message at the bottom of the website says, stock expected in April, 2021. Obviously it doesn't say April 1st, 2021, but it says April, 2021. And then also, as you know, this Friday is a bank holiday. So they probably won't drop anything bank holiday. So it makes sense that they could drop tomorrow, if not early April. If they don't drop tomorrow, then definitely it'll be next week for sure. But yeah, keep an eye on Smiths, guys, please. And guys, alongside Smiths, another stock that you need to keep an eye on is Very for sure. As you know, we made some previous videos. We talked about Very. It didn't drop this week, but we still have tomorrow. As it is with Smiths, Very has managed to get some shipments that came in for them recently. 
So they could either drop tomorrow or then wait till the April window. It's up to them. Who knows? Stock informers have been saying they could drop tomorrow and it's worth keeping an eye on them. So do keep an eye on Very as well, guys. You never know. They could drop as well. So alongside Smiths, when you're doing that whole alert thing or keeping an eye on Smiths, add Very to the list as well if you can for tomorrow. And guys, in regards to next stocks, apart from these stocks that I mentioned to you in the previous clips, as you know, we still haven't gotten anything from John Lewis. We haven't gotten anything from Asda and Argos as well. But these are all stocks that are incoming, guys. These are all stocks that will be coming in April. So these ones I'll talk about in my upcoming videos. And these are ones that you really need to keep an eye on. We're getting stocks so frequently now, guys. I think it's every week that we have a major restock. In April, guys, it'll be even better. If you thought March was good, April will be even better. We'll get one major restock from a major retailer every week. If you're thinking about buying from scalpers and you look at the prices and you think, oh, it's only 100 pounds, 150, please refrain from that, guys. As I always tell my friends as well, when they ask me, should I buy from scalpers? I say it depends. Obviously, scalper needs to be legit. You need to do your due diligence, but sometimes what they say isn't what the truth is, if you see what I mean. They could say the PS5 is in mint condition, but you don't know whether they dropped the box damn on the floor like that. If you can, guys, wait it out, get it from an actual store. It comes with a warranty, all that sort of stuff, bundle. So yeah, please hold on, guys. And guys, now let's quickly talk about Ratchet & Clank. As I told you at the start of the video, Ratchet & Clank, amazing news that the developers are actually releasing a PS5 patch. Now, this is amazing news to me that they're doing this for a lot of games. I'm waiting for Last of Us 2 patch. I'm waiting for some of these patches that please patch this game. That's all I'm saying. We need the patches for all the different games that we love. Bloodborne, where's the patch for Bloodborne? Please bring on Bloodborne's patch. But guys, Ratchet & Clank, as you know, already looks beautiful on the PS5. I was playing it the other night. It looks amazing on the PS5. I don't know whether that's because I'm playing it on performance mode. It raises the resolution anyway. But I'm thinking with the PS5 patch, it will look even more brilliant. Guys, the PS5 patch is free. If you have a physical disc from before, you'll still get the PS5 patch for free. So it's not just a digital copy, it's a physical disc as well. But yeah, guys, do remember this and play Ratchet and Clank if you can with the PS5 patch. And let me know what you think about the graphics. I think the graphics will look insane with the PS5. I also want to give a big shout out to our champion level patrons, Andy Williams, K McGay, Boxplay Loop, Tradesman, Cosmic Man, and finally, Essen Khan Gears as well. Thank you so much for supporting the channel, guys. And guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. As I said, congrats to everyone that managed to cop from EE and Amazon. Do let us know in the comments if you managed to do that. And please keep an eye on Smiths and Very tomorrow as well. I hope they drop. Let's see what happens. I'll let you know. I might do a live stream as well if I can. I don't know if I'll wake up that early because <laughs> I've taken tomorrow off. So I'm gonna lie in if I can. Best of luck, guys, for tomorrow. And as I said, like we'll be doing lots more videos, gaming videos, all that sort of stuff. Live streams. Guys, the next live stream will be this Friday at 9 p.m. So please join us for that as well. And guys, the upcoming drops, if you're asking, as I mentioned, I'll be making another video this weekend. Most likely we'll drop it Saturday or Sunday. I think Sunday might be a better day because that's the best day when you talk about next week's drop. So please watch out for the video on Sunday too. That's when we'll know more information, what's dropping, all that sort of stuff. So I'll come back on Sunday as well. And before that, I'll drop lots of gaming videos as well. So keep an eye out for those as too. And guys, if I don't see you before then, have a great weekend, have a great Easter holiday, Easter bank holiday, and I hope you enjoy the sun. I don't know how the weather is, but it's been really nice. Maybe it'll go down, but still enjoy yourself, go out, meet, meet friends, meet family, you know, obviously within all the rules and stuff. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. And as I always say, stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll catch you again. Bye.